Number 15. Go Sun F Solar Charger. Go Sun, which provides solar energy solutions, announced a new portable solar panel charger designed for electric vehicle users. The Go Sun Solar F Charger allows users to charge their vehicles with solar energy both while on the move and when parked. The device is equipped with panels that can be easily mounted on the roof of the vehicle and are resistant to all weather conditions. The panels can produce a maximum of 1200 watt power and are equipped with additional security measures against theft. Thanks to these features, users can enjoy the comfort of charging their vehicles wherever there is sun. Installation of GoSun Solar EV is very practical. It can be completed by just two people in about 20 minutes. The device can provide an additional range of up to 48 kilometers per day on average. It offers an additional range of 16 to 32 kilometers depending on seasonal and weather conditions. With these features, it offers an ideal solution especially for users who live in apartments and cannot charge their vehicles at home. Number 14. Crypto Solar Tree. Daymac, a Canadian light electric vehicle manufacturer, has unveiled the capacity to mine cryptocurrency using solar energy, a long-held desire for crypto miners. Using Crypto Solar Trees. Rewinding, Daymac announced the creation of the Daymac Spiritus, the world's first electric car capable of generating cryptocurrency. When parked, it begins mining cryptocurrency, has a range of 180 miles on a full charge, and costs $19,995. Clearly, this organization wants more than simply to help you go green, it also wants to earn you money and look good while doing it. With the debut of their new crypto solar tree, their objective is to assist electric vehicles plug in while charging, while also creating cryptocurrency once the mining option is enabled. In other words, the crypto solar tree saves you money on your electricity costs. You can plug in your day Mac and have your car mine for cryptocurrency while also allowing the crypto tree to mine for cryptocurrency. Number 13. Deroni H1X. Deroni H1 is a two-person EVTOL air taxi with a payload capacity of 227 kilograms. In addition, the vehicle can reach a speed of 160 kilometers per hour and has a range of 100 kilometers. Of the total 10 electric motors, eight are VTOL and two are connected to the pusher propeller for forward flight. Louvers on the propellers prevent contact with flying objects. Number 12. QIDI Vida. QIDI Vida smart AR glasses for sports provide increased performance and real-time data while on the go. These smart glasses are lightweight and robust, with an augmented reality display that overlays fitness information such as speed, distance, and heart rate. Perfect for riders. For runners and outdoor enthusiasts, GPS navigation, voice commands, and Bluetooth connectivity provide smooth integration with fitness applications. With built-in sensors, auditory feedback, and safety alarms, you can train more effectively and safely. Capture your activities with the integrated camera and remain inspired with a long battery life. Number 11. In Motion E20. The E20 has a fairly inoffensive appeal right out of the box, coming well packaged with a curved plastic shell in white that covers most of the wheels and internal parts, unlike the more obvious, functional appearance of other InMotion EUCs. Its minimalist design features a black handle that is also curved at the top and pedals that fold up to keep it compact for storage. There's a rubber charging port cover on the back, which neatly doubles as a stand to protect the E20 from damage when not in use. Above is a circular grille for the car's built-in speaker. The E20 also has bi-directional accent lights along the wheel spokes. These come in blue out of the box, but the color can be changed from the app. The E20 also comes with a transformer-type charger, EU or US socket adapter options, and a user manual that advises the owner to use protective equipment with the vehicle, among other things. Number 10. DJI Dock 2. DJI Dock 2, an automated drone docking station, improves productivity and dependability for remote drone operations. The more powerful, but considerably smaller DJI Dock 2 deploys Matrice 3D or 3TD drones with simplicity and safety. Dock 2 is lightweight, has advanced operating capabilities, and cloud-based intelligent functionalities that improve the efficiency and quality of unattended operations. DJI Dock 2 is 75% smaller and 68% lighter than its predecessor, and it can be easily transported by two people, allowing for more flexible installation and lower installation costs. DJI Dock 2 charges the aircraft from 20% to 90% in approximately 32 minutes, providing efficient power for many missions. 
Number 9. REM. If you occasionally desire an electric boost when skateboarding but do not want an electric skateboard, you could like REM. It is simply a portable, power stick that operates independently of the user's board. Limitless Propulsions, a Barcelona-based firm, is currently developing REM, which is being funded through a Kickstarter campaign. CEO, founder Marc Esbarbe Valhonrat developed the concept after seeing a longboarder use a rubber-tipped wooden stick to propel oneself ahead, similar to a land-based stand-up paddleboarder. REM is similar to a stick, except it is made of carbon fiber and has a throttle at the top and an aluminum-framed single-wheel propulsion unit at the bottom. Twisting the knob-shaped throttle activates the unit's 3000W brushless motor, which spins the large polyurethane wheel via a belt drive system. Number 8. Gaia 701. Gaia 701 is a strong and feature-rich ride. This scooter has a 3000W motor and 60 version 30 a lithium battery allowing for speeds up to 45 km per hour and a range of 60 to 80 km on a single charge. The bike features a suspension front fork, hydraulic rear brake, and underseat rear suspension for a smooth ride. The City Coco 701 includes an LCD display, headlights, brake lights, and rear turning lights for safety. The replaceable battery and 6 to 8 hour recharge period make it ideal for daily usage. The GS City Coco 701 is an excellent choice for commuting and cruising about town. Number 7. GAC City Cars At the 2024 Milan Design Week, the Chinese automaker revealed three creative prototype city cars, each with its own set of unique features and uses. The trio, part of the GAC Car Culture Series 3.0, symbolizes the brand's vision for the future of urban mobility and is designed to meet the unique needs of Milan and Guangzhou residents. The small cars, named City Pod, City Box, and City Run, are designed exclusively for everyday city trips, urban distribution, and road speeding, respectively. The City Box is a tiny three-wheeled vehicle inspired by the Italian Piaggio Ape and designed to be a reliable delivery alternative. The City Pod is aimed at urban commuters and is marketed as a perfect answer for the fast-paced city life of Milan and Guangzhou. In terms of appearance, it draws inspiration from the legendary 1950s Assetta, combining timeless attractiveness and modern utility. Finally, the City Run was pitched as an urban commuting option intended toward young people. Its design combines the compactness and functionality of a hatchback with the elegance of a coupe. Number 6. Pulsefire in the South Dakota governor's election, Chrissy Nome distinguished herself by handling her opponent's harsh verbal attacks. She won the election and became the state's first female governor. She is a clever politician, which may explain why she received a flamethrower as a Christmas gift. Gnomes demonstrated it on social media by burning a pile of cardboard crates. The model is called the Pulsefire LRT and costs $630. It weighs only 2.7 kilograms and can discharge flames up to 7.6 meters. It's a novel approach to engaging voters and successful against wheat. Number 5. Moving on. When stalled in traffic, you may observe that most automobiles are only occupied by one or two individuals. Did you realize that one bus can replace 155 cars? Owning a personal automobile is typically perceived as a sign of success. It's like saying I earn enough money to avoid public transit. The Yano design team collaborated to construct a six-seater electric capsule powered by solar panels that travels on a predetermined path, similar to a bus. How does this connect to top brands? Producing such capsules might increase Audi's reputation and lead to more contracts for mass distribution to cities worldwide. Number 4. Vajo Teleport Finland-based virtual reality company Vajo Technology OI introduced its new service Teleport, which allows users to create 3D environments for virtual reality using only their smartphones. Until now, virtual and mixed reality experiences have been difficult to get into, and such content has often been limited to advanced skills or tools created by artists and engineers using photogrammetry. This caused VR scenes to take weeks or even months to create. With Teleport, anyone can use an iPhone to recreate a high-resolution 3D model and turn a room or outdoor environment into a VR scene. This service recreates the environment with real-time lighting, shading, textures, and reflections and allows one to navigate the scene using machine learning and Gaussian splatting, a technique. This means that the person scanning the scene must walk around the entire area and scan it with their smartphone. Once a scene is scanned, it is uploaded to Vajo's cloud and then processed to turn it into a VR scene. Vajo presented a brief demonstration of a garage housing a motorized bicycle featuring high-fidelity shadows and lighting, so much so that even the tread on the tire stood out up close, and the light from the windows softly illuminated the wrenches and other tools waiting to repair the bike. 
Number 3. Pegasus. Nevada's new flying automobile handles like a go-kart and flies like a helicopter. It travels at highway speeds, handles like a go-kart, switches from drive to fly mode in 3 seconds, takes off vertically, and can fly for up to 3 hours thanks to a hybrid drivetrain. It's essentially a tiny, single-seat helicopter with automated quick-fold rotor blades that has been grafted onto a bare-bones open-wheel vehicle chassis made of carbon fiber rods. It's unclear where the electric component of the hybrid drive system fits in, but the combustion power looks to come from a lightweight, buzzy, Pegasus 800 inches two-stroke with roughly 160 horsepower. Number 2. Garaventa 136 Full the Garaventa 136 Full is not your typical funicular railway. Garaventa's model, currently owned by Doppel, gained popularity after being used for the Stu's Bonn in Switzerland. The Saint Bonn funicular has the record for the steepest inclination, reaching 110%. However, how does it work? The secret is in the cylindrical chambers. They automatically tilt to maintain a level floor, even on steep climbs. Additionally, these cabins are easily accessible and can transport goods, making them a marvel of engineering and a must-have for every enthusiast. Number 1. Sky Deck. Sky Deck is a new concept for improving airplanes. It may be used on any aircraft, from tiny business jets to huge long-haul airlines. The concept is to put a transparent capsule with seats in the plane's tail portion, allowing passengers to enjoy breathtaking views in comfort. These seats will likely be more expensive, benefiting airlines. To enhance luxury on bigger planes, an elevator might be constructed to enter the capsule. Sky Deck prioritizes safety and has been constructed to resist bird crashes. The business is in TS with a major aviation component manufacturer and aims to deliver capsules ready for installation. 